Hello everybody, it's Jonna, the Pandora Addict, and I was going to show you my latest haul that I got from Troll Beads at uh, Partridge Creek, and uh, they had a grand event this uh, past weekend, and so I wanted to just share with you what I got. Um, I uh, got several different things, and um, I just... I thought you'd like to see what what what's in here, and I'm, you're getting a first view as I do because I uh, haven't opened it yet, so I don't know what. I mean, I know what I bought, but I don't know what's in here. And please, y'all, subscribe for me. Um, I know I usually say at the end of the video, but please, if nothing else, if you don't watch but like two minutes of this video, please subscribe and like too if you can and always give me comments if you think there's something i need to know or or a question please comment but anyway here we go so we're going to open it up and this time instead of being tied up it's actually because i have two big boxes in here it's actually uh taped <laughs> so here we go here we go, and of course I got my letter, a note. They're always so sweet and a thank you note. Let's see, what else do we have in here? Oh. Okay, and we always Always have candy. So, yay. <laughs> always have some candy. And always have um, the little uh, pamphlets that they give you. Um, like this one teaches you how to make a troll bead, where to start and all that. So, troll bead. <laughs> how to make your own ne necklace or bracelet. That's, where it, that's what it teaches you. <laughs> I know I'm crazy. Y'all just have to bear with me. I don't know which box to open first. This one's heavier. Y'all have to forgive the noise. I am actually outside. Last time I was outside, we had problems. So, it looks like I'm going to have problems too here because I have no scissors. Oh, here we go. It's come undone. Yay! And they have this beautiful black paper with red ribbon to go the with the season. The black paper is going for the Halloween season. So, let's open this up and see what it is because I'm so excited. Because I, I haven't opened it. <laughs> I just got it and I haven't opened it. So, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I don't know what this is, y'all, so. And you'll have to, ex I don't know if I already said this, but you'll have to excuse the noise because I'm outside and it's, it's been quiet and all of a sudden everything's making noise. Cars are going up and down the road. Somebody's working on a car. Kids are playing and there'll be wind chimes too that you'll hear. So you'll know it's an actual uh, real life outside video. <laughs> so here we go. Oh, it's, it's my beads. Of course it's my beads, but. Oh, they're so cool, y'all. Okay, let's get these off and get them on a rod. Okie dokie. Here we go. I wonder what's in the other one, out of curiosity. Okie dokie. Let me get these off. Ah! Keep saying okie dokie. They've been knotted at the end, too, so that they won't um, come off. I'm thinking I might not even put them on a rod and just show them to you this way. That's what I'm thinking. So... 
here we go this one here okay these are the people's uniques these right here these six um this first one here it does give me a little bit of slack i don't want to lose any of my beads but it does give me a little bit of slack the ribbon does okay these are the people's uniques and this time they had a barrel unique and it is called art nouveau and it's black with uh green and blue and it's got a gold line going down it it is so pretty y'all it's so pretty i like it and see how it's got kind of a, a point right here so that's really cool so there's that one this is the second people's unique that i'm showing get up here closer see if we can get closer okay this one is called the rippled mermaid and it's pretty much like the other mermaids that we've had recently except it has um rippled effect on it on the glass the glass has been rippled on top of it so you can see it on the inside and there it is and then next oh how pretty that is so pretty this is my um rainbow mermaid which is absolutely gorgeous i think i'm gonna have to come in some there we go it's got a lot of white on it so you can kind of tell the difference between the colors next is rainbow flower rainbow flower so it's really cool look at that it's got some um what do you call it yellow or green or or chartreuse and blue and orange and of the flowers with little bubbles in them to uh to show off that their flowers you know with the insides there oh that's so cool anyway and on the inside it's got rainbows on the inside i wish i had better light i mean i've got pretty good light but the sun went away so <laughs> it's getting late here so anyway and y'all have to forgive my nails i did not get them done today so and i love this one especially for some reason there this color is just it's just gorgeous this is called the passion lotus and i just there's something about the blue the deep deep blue and the lotus which is a beautiful flower but the blue and the and the white is the lotus is just gorgeous and it's raised up there's something about it being um raised up and and giving it a three-dimensional feel and then we have the rainbow tulip which is really pretty it looks a lot like some of the well the tulip flower that they had in um is it the Netherlands or Holland? <laughs> it's where Troll Beads is from. I'm so sorry. I don't know what I'm talking about. But anyway, and it also looks like some uniques that they had um, at the last grand event that I didn't get any. But it's really beautiful. It's got a um, some um, green or teal looking color to the back of it. And and um the rainbow of the of the tulip itself is just gorgeous and particularly i love the the yellowish green color okay well that's these are the people's uniques so once again this is the rainbow tulip the passion lotus the rainbow flower the rainbow mermaid the rippled mermaid and the art nouveau so they're really, 
They're really nice. Now next is going to be some of my uniques that I got. Now to start with, I got me some puppy prints. Now you're like, okay, why are you getting puppy prints, Donna? And the reason why is because I'm going to make a, a bracelet with representing my babies. And I have um, two females, so two female pugs. So here they are, the two females. It's so cute. The two pink ones. And then I have a white one that, um, his name's Watson. And he is a rescue dog. And he's white, so I thought we would go with him being white. And then I have my other pug, my little boy pug, Yoshi. And so he would have a blue one. And the pink ones are for Winnie and Wednesday. Then I also have, um, is this the Infinity? I think it is. I can't remember right now. Y'all have to forgive me if I've totally forgotten. But the infinity bead. And this time I got one in yellow. No, prosperity. Prosperity bead. Infinity. Prosperity bead. I got this. Um, I have another one that's in an orange color. And this one is yellow with gold on it. Um, so, um, that will go good for um, fall colors. Next, I got a curry bead that has gorgeous um, chartreuse flowers on the sides. And it's got gold lines around the, around the, around the line, around the lines, around the curry lines. And then it has blue and teal. And then there's this one which is just absolutely beautiful. Terry actually pointed this one out to me. Terry from Partridge Creek, she pointed this one out to me. And it is just, it's got red and orange and yellow, and it's just its just so fall. And, and it's got sparkles and glitter. It's just so pretty. I really, I really like it, so. And here we are is another curry bead. This one is uh, either it's black or dark blue. It's kind of hard to tell right here if it's black or dark blue. But um, it might be black. And then it has different color blues on it. So that's really, that's really cool. And then this is my opaque one. Opaque one. Opaque. This is my faceted one that I got. Um, to me, the it's it's a yellow color as well, or a gold color. And to me, the leaves on it look leaves. I'm telling you, the spots on it look like leaves to me. And I've gotten just crazy about leaves lately. And so, um, Terry also suggested this one and showed it to me. Showed me a couple of these, and this is the one I picked. So, it's very cool. Okay, so there's those. I might just pick up on those if I don't watch it. And let's see what's in this one. In this box. Hopefully this one will come off. Yeah, it's coming off. There we go. And we'll see what's in this one. about uh, even though it's been the weekend i've about forgotten what i've gotten already okay here we go y'all oh it's my bracelet it's my bracelet and what all here is here? I'm trying to look. Okay. To start with, I got me two soul connectors. 
I got me two moments connectors. I got, here we go, get closer. One luminous connector. I have one on two already. But they had buy two, get one free. I'm mean, not buy two. Buy three, get one free. And so I went ahead and took advantage of that and got me several extra new beads. This is called the Path of Life bead, which I did not have. and it, It's been around for a while. Once again, Terry suggested this one for me. And this is another uh, free bead that I got with, with my purchase. Because I got enough to do that or whatever. <laughs> I guess I would get this the here hold on for a second I'm going to get the clasp out of here so that we can see these up close I'm trying to here well okay there we go <laughs> okie dokie this is the woodland uh, bead that came out last year with the woodland bracelet. I wasn't able to get the entire bracelet because um, they're out of the, it was a limited edition and they don't have any more of the beads. So, um, but this is the silver that came along with it. And this, y'all, is my barrel. And it is yellow with let's see like a maroon looking spots on the sides and red on the on the other so like i said and it, does it i can't tell if it has glitter or not but like i said earlier um yeah it does it has glitter in the lines i don't know if you can see it by the gold um like I said earlier, definitely going for stuff for fall. So, there's that one. It's really gorgeous. At least I think so. Now, this one is or was at the time when I purchased my uh, barrel beads was the biggest. That's one thing about me. I love big beads or jumbo beads or fatter beads. And this is black. Well, it's not black. It's, well, it depends on how you look at it, I guess. It's black with lavender uh, swirls all the way through it. And on the end, it has the lavender color or the lilac or periwinkle, I guess. I don't know. It's hard to tell what color it is. But it has that on the, in on the ends, and it's opaque. And it has... Um, this is bumpy. It's raised up and it's it's bumpy. So I'm to see that. And this, y'all, is my troll bead. Now I have never seen a troll bead that was black. Or mostly black. I mean it's it's got color, but it has the black too. It's really cool. I mean on the ends on the ends oh I'm coming out of focus on each end it's got some spots along with a straight line a couple of straight lines orange green blue purple pink white some more orange and orange spots and I don't know what this one doesn't have as many, it doesn't have spots on it like this one. This would be kind of cool to have on a fantasy ring. So that is my troll stone, y'all. I thought it was very unique because of it being black mainly. If y'all can see the, the black. Well, that right there is green. Look how dark it is. But this... Right. Well, it looks like this might be green, too. So maybe it's not black. Maybe it's dark green. But still, it's very unusual, I find. 
and there's a white spot there. There's a couple spots here. That's really cool. So that's my troll stone. And here is my beautiful butterfly pendant, which looks like to me is like a malachite. I love malachites. And um, this one, let's see, the thing about malachites is that they wear down real easily and um, lose their uh, faceting real easily but of course if you wear it as a necklace it wouldn't happen as bad so this is my beautiful my favorite color green everybody knows i love green green butterfly and on the other side it's got butterfly as well and i'm going to clasp it on a regular whoops I'm about to knock my camera over a regular um necklace with um that's similar to the um to the um bracelet it goes together with a clasp so i'm going to put it at the bottom like that so anyway i hope y'all like that and that you enjoy it it's a beautiful green all different colors it's so cute and last but not least, I got the Woodland Clasp. So, to go with the Woodland Silver. Like I said, they had both of the silvers, but not the actual bead that came with the with the uh, limited edition bracelet that came out last year. And I, I really regret not getting it. It might not have been last year. It might have, I don't think it was last year. I think it was the year before. So, I'm thinking it was 2022 that it came out. But anyway, and that's that. And I, with any clasp, you always get a free uh, bracelet, a free uh, silver bracelet. So here we go is my silver bracelet. And there goes all my pretties. And here's everything together. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, <laughs> it was kind of funny with all the sounds and everything, but I really appreciate everybody watching to the end. And um, I really would appreciate a subscribe and a like and comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you like something um, in particular more than another one. Let, let me know if you like my choices. Um, but thanks a lot for watching. Love you. See you. Bye.